It's easier to stick to a goal the faster you see the results. By following a plan and using some discipline, you can find yourself with more money at the end of the week or month and in time, the year. None of these 20 ideas will make you a fortune, but they can grow your savings quickly. Hello everyone and welcome back to the Daytime Dollar. Today we will discuss some tricks to save money fast. Number 1. Make a budget. Assessing your spending is a way to find areas where you may be wasting money. This can be an eye-opening process. Budgeting will help you plan your spending. Bank and credit card statements can help you assess past spending. You can sign up for Bankrate's My Money to categorize your spending transactions and identify ways to cut back and improve your financial health. Number 2. Cancel unnecessary subscription services. To be an effective saver, get rid of unnecessary subscriptions. Perhaps you signed up for a new streaming service for the free promotional period but forgot to cancel it. Or maybe you have a gym membership you no longer use. Go through your monthly credit card or bank statements to look for recurring subscription charges. Once you've canceled any unnecessary services, put that money into your savings account. Number 3. Try a no-spend day. Not spending any money in a day or week can help you quickly save money. This can force you to think about every dollar you spend. After a no-spend day or days, you may also realize your spending habits have improved. Number 4. Set up a split deposit. Saving automatically is a great way to save. Have some of your paycheck deposited right into a savings account or your bank might be able to set recurring transfers from checking savings. Number 5. Shop around for insurance. Shopping around for insurance can help you save money. Sometimes you'll find a better deal as a new customer or you can contact your existing insurer to ask them to lower your current rate if it has gone up. Bundling insurance products with the same insurance company can also help you save. Number 6. Revaluate your housing costs. Housing costs, such as rent or mortgage payments, are some of the largest expenses in most budgets. Moving to a place with a lower rent could help you start saving immediately. Refinancing your mortgage can help you save money on monthly payments and in the long run. But make sure it makes sense for your situation. Number 7. Sell unwanted items. Sell items you don't need for an injection of cash fast. Look at your closet, attic, garage, or storage space to find the dress or ring or hiking boots you no longer wear. Then, write a post about the item S and sell them on, say, eBay or Nextdoor. You could also head to the local thrift store to sell items you no longer use. A garage sale might be an option for selling many items at once. Whatever approach you take, do your homework to avoid regrets. Make sure you know the value of an item before you sell it for less than it is worth. Number 8. Earn cash back on your purchases. Even when times are toughest, you'll still need to spend money on essentials, so you might as well be rewarded with cash back. There are cashback credit cards that can help you collect cash back on your purchases. Some don't even have an annual fee. Your existing credit card might also have cashback offers at certain retailers, but you might need to opt in to redeem this reward. These offers may have an expiration date or other terms and conditions, so double check to ensure you're not caught off guard. Cashback apps might also be an option to consider before you start shopping for new credit cards. Number 9. Automate your savings. If you have a fixed monthly income, consider automating your savings contributions each month. This means setting up an automated transfer from your daily spending account to your savings account each month. By automating your savings, you further reduce your chance of using these funds to cover your daily expenses. To make saving a little easier, consider creating your own rules. Rules is an in-app feature that lets you automatically move money between your main account and your spaces. It's a great hands-off way to kickstart your savings. Number 10 take up a side hustle. If you want to seriously boost your monthly savings, it's worth considering taking up a side hustle. This could mean anything from working a few evening shifts at a bar or restaurant after your office job, securing a few freelance gigs, becoming a virtual assistant, or perhaps even pet sitting. If you can afford to do so, it can be particularly motivating to put all the money generated from your side hustles straight into your savings account. However, be wary of burning out. Your mental health is more important than trying to achieve any savings goal. Number 11. Try to fix things yourself. A great way to make some significant savings is to try to fix anything that breaks yourself. Thanks to YouTube and the internet at large, you can now find out how to fix pretty much anything online. From leaky pipes to the zipper on your jeans, it's always more cost-efficient to fix these things yourself rather than pay someone else to do it or replace them entirely. So guys, that was all about today's topic. See you soon in the next video. Goodbye.